All right, so the guys at Pale Mafia smuggled two kilograms of dope kits to Canada. And in today's video, I want to show you guys exactly what they sent. I have no idea. It's a surprise. Let's see what we got inside of this. I'm going to go change in the bathroom. So wait for me here for one second. All right, so we have our first kit and goddamn Pale Mafia stuff feels so good. So um, this long sleeve thermal jacket, I have one in black already and it was one of my favorite one. So I feel the look is great here, black vest, navy one. So we have some great PMCC branding there, super minimal. And it's not too much of a thick bib. I've seen thicker winter bib, but I've seen also uh, less thicker ones. So I feel it's just in the right in the middle. It's great. You have your reflective details. So you're seen at night, out front and back, pretty much everywhere. This vest looks great. And what I love about these vests is especially when you can untie from the bottom so you can have access to your pockets. All right, next we have some things that I would say it's an indoor kit. So we have a bib and a base layer. Let's go put it on and see what it feels like. All right, guys, so we got kit number two, which is the base layer and the bib. Guys, the PMCC bib is the best thing in the world. It's such a huge gripper on the leg. It's just really comfortable. I've tried over 20 different brands in terms of bibs and Pell Mafia is definitely in the top two or three. Base layer fits good if I'm putting the thermal vest that I had previously, it would be perfect thing to put right under it. Now I would be ready for some spring action, seven to 12 degrees, I would be super comfortable with that. And I could add leg warmers and shit, yo, speaking of legs, you see what's on my legs? What is that? Hair. What is that? Hair. hair, hair, this is the start of the season. I need to get rid of that, what do you think, yo? Think you do? I think I got something right here to get, to uh, take care of everything, and it's uh, from the guys at Manscaped. Little, little plug there, but the guys at Manscaped saw my airy legs the other day uh, in another video, and they say, Charles, we do believe that your legs uh, deserve better, and not only your legs, but also your balls. And this kid got everything I need to take care of everything down there, so we'll make sure that these airy legs don't come back until the end of the season. <laughs> All right, so big shout out to Manscaped for sponsoring this though. So if you are in the market for some groomings for your legs or your balls, there will be a link in the description down below with the discount so you guys can get some great products at an affordable price. All right, guys, so for the next outfit, we have one black bib, a PMCC, and four different jerseys. Let's go straight, test them out. All right, so we have the PMCC bib, PMCC jersey, and this color is called the Beat. Look how great this looks. I feel uh, it goes very well with my skin tones. The back is great. The pockets are black as well. And yeah, this looks great. One of my favorites so far. It's your favorite so far? Yeah, yeah. So let's try another one. Next, we have a core jersey. So the core line is the most affordable line from Middle Mafia. Definitely you can tell that the quality or the line is inferior to the PMCC, but it's still a very good jersey. It's more out there, but uh, I like it. Yeah? Yeah. All right, so next, we have another gray color. I feel like Pell Mafia really stepped up their colors this year. More neutral, huh? I but feel I like, like uh, yeah. this, this color, this skin tone, brown in my darker skin, once I'll be a bit more tan from, from the summer, will look great. And the complementary colors is very nice. This is like a tan here. Same with the pockets. We have some tan in the rear. All right, so the last jersey we have today, uh, we're getting back to the PMCC collection. This this is very out there. First of all, you you get seen by cars, so it's safer to have brighter colors. Compared to the last year PMCC, they're a bit less grippy. This is what I just realized. But the length is just right. The color is great. Branding is great. What's the color in the back? Is it black? Black kit. Black. And the last kit we have today, in terms of colors, it's again uh, different. Olive green. So if you show up to your uh, local uh, training center during the winter time with this, I would not be shy. I feel it looks great. All right, so in terms of the accessories, we have a vast selection here. So of course, we have white socks. Uh, if your socks are not white, I don't know what you're doing. This is the color for cycling, is white socks. Uh, they sent over a neck warmer, and I believe that their neck warmer is 
quite interesting. The texture is so nice. So you can put it on top there. It's super warm and can cover your ears. Next again, this is my second pair of Pale Mafia gloves and these are very nice. Uh, you can see all the grip that they have on the inside. Uh, they have those little uh, honeycomb shape. It's very grippy so your hands are not moving from the handlebar. And they're also touch control which we always use our phone and our fingers here so that's good to have. Next, water bottle. Probably gonna end up using it. And now, leg and arm warmers. So what's great about these, the grip on the upper end so it stays right up to your arm. And on the bottom you also have additional grip there. It's a different fabric and it do feel a lot nicer around the wrist. Uh, I can start the ride and be warm and if it gets too hot outside, you can take them off, put it back into the back of the jersey. The leg warmers, they have a zipper at the bottom, silicone band, so it do stay in place. The worst thing that can happen with leg warmers is that they fall down your jersey on top. It do look very good. Usually when I start a ride with arm warmers, I always also I uh, carry no sleeve vest. This is the style I would go for, personally. Colored jersey with a black vest, black arm warmers. It looks very good. I'm good to ride in seven, eight, nine degrees, and all the way up to 12, 14, 15. Just take the arm warmers off and you're good. All right guys, so this was it for my try on the whole. Uh, it was raining outside at the moment, so this is why we're doing this indoor video. So I hope I'm trying something. I hope you like uh, to see me wear some stuff. If you wanna push your hands on the, some of the kits or all the kits I wore today, they will be linked in the description down below. I do not believe there's a, still an active discount code. If this change over the, in the future, I, I will update the description as well. All right guys, so if you enjoyed this video, please don't forget to leave a thumbs up, subscribe if you aren't already. And my name is Charles and I will see you guys on the road or to the next video. Peace.